Hey, hey, welcome back to free software tips. So today I'll be showing you another video tutorial on how you can fix the Sims 4 MS VCP120, the DLL, was not found or error on your computer. So before we get started, be sure to hit that subscribe button and bell notification if you haven't subscribed on this channel yet to get updated with the latest tips and tricks on this channel. So without further ado, let's get started. So before we get started, this video will address the issue that whenever you try running the Sims 4, it will show you this kind of um, system error that says that the code execution cannot be proceeded because of the msvcp120 dll so we can now go ahead and just simply close this one first so the first thing that we can do is to update our graphics drivers so depending on which graphics driver are you using so i have here uh amd graphics driver currently on my system so go ahead and look for the radeon software on your system tray and open up the radeon software if you don't have that one, go ahead and look for AMD Radeon software and then open it up. Depending on the model of your graphics card, you might have a different interface. So here on my um, Radeon software, I could uh, just simply click on the check for updates. And as you can see here that my graphics driver is currently up to date. But if you're using a different um, graphics card manufacturer such as NVIDIA and Intel, could go ahead and close this window and open up the start menu and look for device manager open up the device manager control panel app and you'll be able to see your graphics adapter right here under the display adapters if you have nvidia or intel you could just go ahead and look for the name of your graphics card driver right here and then go to um, google.com and i'm going to try for example just simply search nvidia drivers and click on the nvidia.com download drivers website i'll just put this link on on the description or on the website so that you could easily go here select the appropriate product type and product series of your graphics card and then go ahead and click the search button and download your graphics driver same with the intel graphics card just simply search for intel graphics driver and then be sure to have your intel graphics drivers updated so once done, you can go ahead and try restarting your computer and see if that would fix your problem. But if after updating the graphics driver, you still encounter this one, you could go ahead and go to the second solution. Go ahead and close all this window and then open up this link. Again, this link will be available on the description or on the cards on this video. So go to the fix number two, which is to install the required DLL component. So I have posted here the MSVCP120. So you simply download that one. Once done, you could go ahead and minimize the browser first, and then open up the um, zip file, and then look for your the Sims um, for app or game shortcut file. It's uh, typically located on your desktop right here. Just simply right click on it and click on the open file location. You could also do that by searching on the start menu. Right click the search result on the start menu and click on the open file location. You might be taken to this page. You simply right click and click on the open file location. And once you're already on this page right here, that shows you this TSA underscore X64. Just simply drag and drop this msvcp120.dll file. So once done, go ahead and relaunch the Sims 4 and see if that will fix the problem. Make sure to allow that one on the firewall. And as you can see, it's now loaded up and uh, working. So um, if everything still fails, you could go ahead and try reinstalling the game. As I have mentioned on the possible third solution on the website, since it could uh, be possibly corrupted or your installation files could be corrupted. So thanks for watching. If this video was helpful, don't forget to leave your comments and feedbacks down below. And also don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tips. Till then, see you again in my next videos.